What's up guys today we back with the BO today we got the Dutch forward Memphis the Pie Let's get it for the new people don't forget to subscribe like share let's go Memphis started with his career at PSV Eindhoven with influence of the manager Philip Koku he became one of the best players in PSV with scoring 49 goals in 124 games in the season 2014-2015 being the top scorer of the Eredivisie. He became a big player in PSV in 2014-2015 season scoring 22 goals in 30 games and he helped the team with the first title since 2008 that time. It's crazy. He also won the Dutch Football Player of the Year that season and also that season named him as the best young player by French football. In 2015, after killing it in the World Cup as well, scoring goals, Memphis Depay made a move to Manchester United for 25 million. Crazy. With 33 games there and only scoring two goals, that was not a good season for Memphis Depay. He went to Lyon in January 2017. That was really his season at Lyon. That was, bro. Leon is lion as well. His sure name is lion as well. You know, he got a tattoo in his back, bro. In Leon, he was like at home, bro. No cap. The way he was scoring and killing it, bro. That was just on point, man. Bro, I'm not gonna lie. Manchester United, they had like the rounds before going to the Champions League with Manchester United. He was killing it as well. I'm not gonna lie. Let's, bro. He was killing it. No cap. But yeah, in Leon with 139 appearance and 63 goals. What a season, bro. Sure. 2021, he joined Barcelona. Dream transfer. I feel like he had a great season as well there, bro. But I feel like injury made it kind of hard to just fill it in. After that, he went to Atletico Madrid. Atletico Madrid, he killed it as well. But as well, the injury came. That's why, you know, unfortunately, he went away. And right now, he's going to Corinthians. That's crazy. Shocking as well, bro. But... It's crazy, man. It's going to Brazil, Corinthians. So uh, let's check a little bit about the early life, his style of play, and as well, we're gonna check his highlights. So yeah, man, let's go. Memphis Depay was born in a small village called Mordrecht in south of Holland to a Dutch mother and a Ghanaian father. But the moment he was four, both of the parents split. His father walked out of the family. That's crazy, bro. At four years old, his father walks out of the family, more or less. And that's the reason in 2012 Memphis dropped the name of the Pai because his father was away and abandoned him. And listen, his career didn't start at PSV. When I said PSV, I mean professionally. But he was first in the club at Mordecht. After Mordecht, he went to Sparta Rotterdam. That is a professional club as well. At the age of eight, he was scouted by Sparta Rotterdam. It only took three seasons. Crazy. Three seasons, they was checking him out, bro sick the club chairman of the club said as well bro memphis by you was already complete man they was like bro what are you doing here bro <laughs> Memphis Depay is two-footed and very strong a lot of people said when they played Memphis Depay made like five goals seven one seven zero five goals sick and when he turned 12 he got a lot of eyes of big clubs like PSV Ajax and final his grandfather was a big fan of Ajax so he was like bro not PSV but then after that he just said bro I think PSV is the best for you so Memphis Depay went to PSV but just think about it bro if Memphis Depay went to Ajax sick 2011 was his first debut in the first team of PSV it's crazy but like I said 2013 2014 was his breakthrough season as well scoring his first goal in the UEFA competition bro I remember this season like yesterday bro he was killing it bro killing it with free kicks as well but people was like bro this guy is the new ronaldo like cristiano ronaldo bro cristiano ronaldo was as well saying bro i think this guy is gonna be a big one bro it's crazy and with the other like i said top scorer of the early vc killing it after that went to the world cup as well killed it there bro he got a tattoo in the back as well sick of the brazil Sick man, and after that, Manchester United, Lyon, Lyon, Barcelona, Atletico Madrid, Corinthians. Let's go to the national team history. On 50 October 2013, he made his first debut at the World Cup. Sick came in as a substitute, made a goal, the winning goal as well, versus Australia. And he also became the youngest Dutchman to score a goal at the World Cup. 20 years old as well versus Chile he scored a goal with the assist of the great legend Iron Robber 
sick and on 11 july he got named for the best young players around the world with paul pogba and rafael Ferran. and paul pogba won that so unfortunately after long games multiple goals being as well one of the top scorers of the national team of the netherlands he's almost at only four goals bro then he's the top scorer of the national team of the netherlands that's sick so he's almost 11 years at the national team that's sick as well bro consistent as well let's check his style of play people said the style of play is kind of angry aggressive he's right footed he's a left winger as well who cuts into the right foot he's a pacey and a tricky player his direct running makes it really difficult for the defenders and he also got a free kick ability i already said that at the psv early life sick and in 2014-2015, he was statistically the best set-piece taker in Europe. It's going seven times with 33 attempts. The trainer Ronald Koeman talks highly of Memphis Depay. Some people call him arrogant and some people call him a little bit cocky. I remember it was a lot of fuss when he had a head. He was like one of the first players. He was the first player that came with the fashion and stuff in the football game as well before the internet. So people was like, bro, a lot of people was hating him, the Dutch side. So yeah, that was crazy and that did a lot to him. He was like, okay, so y'all hating. Let's do this again and again and again. And now people are more welcome about that when people step in with fashion. People are making photographs right now if you go to Interlands. Bro, look at France, look at Belgium, bro. But Memphis Depay, he was the first one, bro. No cap. Memphis Depay has been compared with Cristiano Ronaldo and Aaron Robert. Sick. As well. 2017 he made this musical career with rapping at that moment he made a freestyle with Quincy Promes another football player that's another story for another time after that he made a lot of tracks a lot of a lot of songs bro no cap bro my favorite song is uh no love bro that song is sketchy no cap but yeah man uh we came to an end let's check the highlights of Memphis Depay Yeah, that was the highlights, bro. I hope he will kill it at uh, Coincia. Shout out to all the Coincia fans as well, as well the Memphis Depay fans and the Dutch people. Yeah, I, I know I'm Dutch. I'm Dutch. I know. I know it. Okay. So, yeah. um, Yeah, that was the video. I hope y'all like it. Tell me down below if y'all want more. Tell me down below which play is next as well. Shout out to Memphis Depay as well and the team. Let's get it. Air Force.